We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to the Freak Show. I am your host today, Bumpy Squiggums, and we're diving in. We're checking out the latest from Square Enix, Harvestella. It is due out today, November 4th, 2022. You guys will be able to grab it and play it, I believe, on Steam and or the Nintendo Switch. That being said, a big shout out and a thank you to Square Enix. We're going to be able to code for this. It does mean a lot and it is greatly appreciated. Thank you so very much. And, of course, guys and gals, beware of spoilers as we are going to be diving in and we're going to be playing. So, let's get into it. Text language, voice language, okay. Seems good to me. Let's do it. We have male, female, and non-binary as uh, gender selections. All right. Wait, what, what did I choose? Does it, do they look any different? Huh. Oh, okay, sure. Interesting. Okay, cool. Um, so is it literally just some slight skin tone changes? All right, sure, let's go with this. Oh, we can, okay, we can do the hair color as well. Huh? Okay, we can change eye color. I, I'm, I'm always a sucker for green eyes, but let's let's go with something a little bit different. We'll go with that one. Here I go. How's this? Okay. Name is Ein. Sure. Let's do it. Uh, the game will begin. Confirm this character. Uh, yeah, I, I suppose so. Ein, Ein, uh, uh, they're, they're not gonna talk? Okay. Rise and shine, sleepyhead, it's time to wake up. Yeah, it is. It is always time to wake up. Oh, uh, probably not the way and place and where you should be sleeping. Just saying, man. Seems a tad dangerous. Oh. Hello. Who are you? Oh. Well, that seems useful. She got some real long hair. Like, real long. You should be all better now. Come on. Let's go. Fascinating. Weird side ponytail situation going on there. Use the left to walk. Huh. Over here. Hey, we talking to you. We don't want you over here. Not back that way. Oh, this is weird. I, I, I'm not gonna lie. Not what I expected uh, as a start. Uh, not that I really had expectations. But uh, this this wasn't it. Uh, what are you doing? Out and about tonight of all nights. Hurry home while you still have air in your lungs. Oh, I can jump. That's not what I would have made a jump button be, but okay. Big scary monsters will gobble you up if you're still outside when quietest comes. Sorry, mommy said um, not to open the door. Looks like there's no way to get in. All right, well, I guess Quietus is here. What's up? You might just be the one who could save the world and the girl. Are you the girl? Uh, what do you mean save? Who are you? Where am I? Who are you? I can't tell you that yet. There will come a time when you will have to choose between this world and the one that existed 
until now. But don't forget that this is the story of your world. And as long as you love it, you will find a way. So, no matter how hard it gets, no matter how hopeless it may feel at times, don't turn away from it. Uh, okay. I'm not gonna lie. It's a pretty weird start. But I suppose we're here for it. Alright, what do we got now? Just walking out into a field? Oh, toward a cliff. Uh, okay. What's with all the mystical particle? Oh, well, that's impressive looking. Huh. Oh. Uh. What? Harvestella. Okay. That was weird. A little weird. Uh, why now? I should be out on doctor's rounds. Excuse me, you. Don't you think it's about time you woke up now? No? no that's fine. I have something for that. What do you got? Oh. Apparently you can cast magical healing stuffs. Oh, you're awake. Forget I said that. It's not like I was going to use magic on you to wake you up or anything. Uh, who are you? It's just not. People don't seem to want to answer this question. Oh, oh, she did. Okay. I'm Cress. I'm the doctor of Lethe Village. It's the town at the bottom of this hill. We call Bird's Eye Bray. That's my turn. I don't think I've seen you around here before. No local in the right mind would be out walking around during Quietus. Are you a traveler or something? What's Quietus? Hmm. It seems like your memory is a bit fuzzy. Well, never mind. I've got to go. Come to my clinic in Leth or Lethe when you're feeling a bit more with it. Just those heels and, and on that terrain, huh? Okay, story. This icon indicates a place where the story will progress. Okay. Makes sense. We... We can't fall off of this, can we? No, good. Give me, they give me a, a, a ledge that I can look out. At, what is that supposed to be? Is that like a flower? Or some sort of crystalline structure? I mean, it looks cool. Uh, somebody left their hex grid in front of me. Hey, anybody can claim the hex grid? No? Uh, oh, okay. Right, I'm just gonna go this way now. Hey, there's a box. Hey, it's a storage box. Yay! Alright. You can store items in yellow storage boxes. Uh-huh. All of the storage boxes are connected to each other on the inside. I mean, that doesn't really help me right now, but it's good to know. So that's the town. Was there anything else to do? I feel like they've blocked me off from everything else. It's fair. All right. Welcome to the town. It looks lovely. Little kids playing. You got some water running through the town. All the plant life. That thing in the background. Lethe Village. 
I'm sure it's just like Lathe Village or something. Hey, are you okay? You look kind of out of it. Oh, I know. Do you? You're the one Cress was talking about. You were found collapsed on the hill, right? Yep, that's me. Anyway, I'm Van. This is Leth Lathe Village. If you're looking for Crest, she's probably in her clinic. Where is her... Can you show me where it is, please? Oh, you want me to take you? Sorry, no can do. Oh, wow. I may not look it, but I'm actually super busy right now. I'm right in the middle of a game of Princess and the Omen. And after this, I'm going to play Canelu. Catch with Vent and Erwin. It's not hard to find, though. It's at the top of the hill in the square. You can't miss it. Thanks, weird child. Or Van, as it were. Thanks, Van. Appreciate you. It's really easy to get there. Just follow the street, then climb the steps from the village square. All right. Thanks. Well, see you later. I'm going to get back to my game. All right. Good luck. You have tiny feet. You can view the map by pressing the whatever button that's supposed to be. Is that the start button? Select button? I don't... I have no idea. A button. Ah, it is a select button. I will always call it select. I'm sorry. I'm an old man. Leave me alone. Let me be grumpy. I don't know why they ever changed it from start and select to like three lines and, uh, and two squares. Like, what, what the heck does that mean? It will always be start and select. We have a lot of people to talk to. This town is pretty vibrant and lively. What you doing over here? I'll talk to the brat first. What's up? I promised to play Princess in the Omen with Van and uh, Malika today. Cool. Who are you? Oh, a traveler. Welcome to Laith Village. Laith benefits from all four sea slight, so we experience all four seasons here. It makes life very comfortable. Look at these things. Hey. Hey. I'm talking to you. Quietus has passed. I can finally hang all this laundry I let pile it up. All right. Okay. Sure. Yep. Although Quietus is pretty, isn't it? Uh, I think that's what makes it all the more unsettling. I wonder if that's what life after death looks like. Oh my, it's not like me to get so grimly poetic. Yeah, maybe. What's up? We got into this merchant business all thanks to the mayor. That's why I need to make more business partners so I can repay that debt. Well, we can't do that here. What's up? I'm so grateful for Van and Vent. It's thanks to those boys that Malika can have fun, not feel the littlest bit lonely. All right, well, cool. This is quite the town. Really a lot going on. Hey, aren't you Van? Doesn't matter how many times we play Princess in the Omen, never gets boring. All right, let's head to where we're supposed to be going. We got a little bit of the old slice of life here. There's a lot to still see, but I'm here for uh, moving along. We'll advance the plot a little bit. We'll talk to a few more people along the way. What's up, kid? Hey. Mom and Dad were wrong. He really did care. What does that mean? Oh, who does? Quietus is penance. Payment for relying on the monolite for anything and everything. In my day, you did what you... You did what you did with your own sweat and tears. Such a pity. Quietus gets longer every year. At this rate, Quietus will be with us all year round. Well, that sounds bad. Hey, you two. Some snooty guy has been coming by the general store. I'm getting the feeling recently that my girlfriend really seems to like him. I hope it's just my imagination. Sometimes the sea slight order comes to town with this prim and proper looking girl in their entourage. She's so pretty. I just know my boyfriend can't keep his eyes off her when she's here. Hey, y'all two need to communicate a little bit. Y you two should talk to one another. Because, uh... I feel like you both have some thoughts and probably both are wrong. Just saying. A little communication goes a long way. Alright, let's open the door.
with that Cress. Jim, you're back? Now that you're here, would you mind mixing up the mayor's medicine? Um... Uh, oh, it's you. Welcome, come in. How are you feeling? Remembering anything yet? Nope. Not a thing. Oh, I see. Well, you were outside during Quietus. What is Quietus? Let's try this again. Can you answer me now? Oh dear, you've forgotten about Quietus too. Even we doctors still know very little about it. Quietus is the season of death when dust from the sea light is abnormally emitted into the atmosphere. It comes in between the four seasons. We believe the dust can be deadly if it enters the body. So everyone usually stays inside during Quietus. Now then, come over here, please. Uh, why are you just standing there? I'm about to give you a medical exam. Oh, really? I suppose I I could use a checkup. Chris gives us a medical exam. For now, your body seems to be in working order. You're very lucky for someone who fell ill during quietness. It's a miracle you're still alive. Anyway, this works out for me too. I was just running out of beds, so it's a good thing you're better now. So now, regarding your next... Oh, that doesn't sound like a good thing. Was that an earthquake? Why did the time change? It's so dark out. Oh no. Chris, it's an emergency! Oh no, Dim! What was that shaking just now? The sea slide is acting weird, come quick! Uh oh. What could those tremors have been? Go after Crest and Dim. Ah, it's danger music right away. Ah, I'm, in, I'm, in, I'm here for it. I'm into it. I like it. Oh no. That seems bad. Oh, this is divine retribution. Oh, time has come. Sea slide is intensifying, but why? Why this is meant to be over already? Look! Up in the sky! It's a bird! No, it's whatever that. I guess that's the sea slide. Uh oh. Oh, it's going nuclear. Oh. Well, that can't be good. gonna be that girl that we're supposed to save nope well at least I don't think so what well, what was that did you see that I told you it's divine punishment D did it land in the north square I'm scared Look at you two scaredy cats. Our town is in peril. We've got to go and find out what's happening. That's not a good idea, children. What? No. Wait. Hey, don't run off like that. Damn, let's go too. There might be casualties at the scene. Uh, well, I mean, I got no skin in the game, so I'm probably just going to go and take a nap. So I'm, I'm, I'm real... I'm just, okay. So I'm real sleepy, but... We'll find out what's going on, because I don't have a clue. Oh. Well, that looks... Messy. Huh. I can't believe it. How could something so massive fall out of the sky? Imagine if the Order were here today. 
Imagine how many people would have been injured. I hope everyone's alright. On the bright side, it looks like no one got hurt. Stay away from the crystal, everyone. It could be it could have harmful effects on the body. When someone inform the mayor, he should be back in town by now. We will. Vent van, come on. It's our time to shine. Let's go. Yeah. Alright, uh alright everyone. Show's over. We'll take it over or we'll take over from here. So the rest of you, you can go home. I mean, really? Oh, they're just fine with it. Okay. Hey, this this is a ship. There's a thing right there. I see it. There's a door. Oh, you must be the traveler my sister told me about. You better go home, too. Uh-oh. Oh, wait. Is this... See, look, told you there's a door right there. An entrance? You mean you can go inside? Apparently. Well, I mean, I'm going in too. I'll talk to you, I guess. It doesn't look all too different from the sea slide. This what fell out of the sky it is oh, it is almost fell in the in the larva the lava all right inside we go hey what are you doing over here no one told you to go in there i'll have a look inside don't worry i'll be fine but you're still recovering Head deeper into the crystal. What the heck? Uh, uh, are you alright? Come on, stay with me. They're in pain, but still breathing. Red. On this. Hey, are you okay? What's going on in there? I just beat this guy up. There's a person inside. I need a hand. A hand with what? Just get in here. What is this? That's... Traveler, get away from it now! But why? We have to get them treated. Are you crazy? Treat an omen? Oh. Oh, right. You're an amnesiac. Um, aren't you? That eh, probably doesn't mean much to you. Well, long story short, omens are trouble. They might be the ones behind quietness. This one's injured right now. I'm just gonna leave it here. You got me. You're right, I can't pretend I didn't see it. Isn't that right, Dad? What? Come on, let's carry it outside. Oh, so Papa had the same uh, problem, huh? I like how we're calling it an it an it. Oh, good sound good. Chris, that's it was inside. It's still alive. It's not what I meant. Yes, I know, but I couldn't just leave it there. Press, dim, have you found out anything about the flying object? It's the mayor. Mayor! Uh oh. <laughs> My goodness, I'm astounded. This is the crystal that crash landed here? It's enormous! Mayor, there was an omen inside. Oh! Yes, it does look like one. Mayor, please tell her we're not helping any omens. This was clearly all they're doing anyway. It looks like he's in pain. Or it's in pain. And how does that concern you? Are you the traveler I've been hearing about? I heard rumors that you came from afar during Quietus. 
Yes, this is the person from the rumors. It's just been one thing after another. What on earth is going on? Mayor, all my beds are still full from last week's incident. But I can't just leave this wounded omen or this traveler here either. Indeed. But we cannot provide refuge to an omen in our town. I thought so, but as a doctor, I can't leave behind the injured under any circumstances. Calm down, Press. I just said we cannot keep the omen inside of Lath Village. What do you mean? There's a spare shed on Bird's Eye Bray, is there? No one would notice if you took it there. I grant you permission to treat it there until it regains consciousness. Ah. Now to carry this omen over to Bird's Eye Bray. Would you lend me a hand, Traveler? Oh, you're gonna help me? Or are like, we all gonna do it? Like, what, 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 are we, what are we talking here? Hmm. I won't be able to treat this omen if I can't get under its armor. What is this thing made of? It just won't come off. That's why it's pointless even trying to treat an omen. Oh, sorry, that was the kid. I suppose all you can do for now is let it rest. Now, as for you, what brought you to our town? Uh -huh. Mayor, his memory was affected by quietus. I see. You are incredibly lucky to make it this far out during quietus. A girl saved me. It's that girl. A girl? Hmm, none of the villagers should have been out at that time. His body was in a weakened state at the time. It's not unlikely that he may have experienced hallucinations. Hmm, perhaps. In any case, he could probably do with some rest. This shed has been vacant ever since the last owner left. You may use it as you please. This is a quite the shed, my god. Now, excuse me, but I must be on my way to a village meeting. We have to decide on a plan of action regarding the crystal that landed here. Press Dim, I'm leaving the rest with you. Alright, thanks, Mayor. Appreciate you. You got tiny feet, too. This is the land of the tiny feet. That dude's got big shorts. Crass, are you sure you want to take in this omen? Yes. There you go, getting too involved again. You put yourself on the line too much. I'm going back to finish the rounds. Sorry, I've been so preoccupied with everything going on at the moment. Tired too. Yeah, you've been through much more than I have. Take it easy for the rest of the day. I'm sure your body must still be fighting off the effects of quietness. I'll leave you to it. I'm coming back to check on you tomorrow, alright? Deal. You're suddenly overcome with the feeling of tiredness. Time to get some rest. Alright, guys, gals, ladies, and gentlemen. That is going to do it for our very first episode. Again, I said at the start, I'll say it again now. Beware spoilers, as obviously we're going through story beats and everything else. So, if you guys don't want to see the game spoiled for you in any way, then, well, probably shouldn't be watching the Let's Play, I suppose. But for those of you who are here to see some of the storyline and then maybe pick up the game yourselves, by all means, feel free to uh, trudge along in the, you know, in the Let's Play with me and in the trenches as we go around and we get some stuff accomplished. Anyway, uh, big shout out and a thank you once again to Square Enix for giving me up with the code for this. It means a lot and it is truly, truly appreciated. Thank you so much. And until the very next episode, folks, like, subscribe, share, do long division, whatever it is you feel like doing for the algorithm, do it. It helps. It's great. It's glorious. It's wonderful. If you want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, publisher, any of that stuff, down below, description of the video, various links, always there. I've been your host, Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer. <laughs>